Welcome to How To Fridays. In this guide, we will show you how to track Active Directory group and organizational unit changes using native tools. First, we need to configure the audit settings. Open Group Management Console, edit the default domain policy, go to Computer Configuration, Policies, Window Settings, Security Settings, Local Policies, Audit Policy. Define the Audit Account Management and Audit Directory Service Access to Success. Go to the event log, set the maximum security log size to one, at least one gigabyte. And the retention method for the security log to overwrite as needed. Run the gp update slash force command. Open ADSI Edit, connect to the default naming context, right click on the domain DNS object with the name of your domain, choose Properties, Security, Advanced, Auditing, Add Principal, Everyone, Type set that to success applies to set that to this object and descendant objects and in the permissions select all check boxes except full control list contents read all properties read permissions and click OK Now let's make some changes to groups in our Active Directory. Open Active Directory Users and Computers. First, let's rename a security group from Manufacturing to Assembly Group. Then, let's create a distribution group with the name Painting. And finally, let's delete the Office Organizational Unit. So let's audit all these changes. Run the Event Viewer and filter the security log for Event ID 4737. So here we can see that the assembly group was changed by the administrator. Now let's filter the log for event ID 4749 in order to track distribution group creation. So here we can see that the painting group was created. And finally, filter the log for event ID 4662 in order to track organizational unit changes. And here we can see that the office organizational unit was deleted by the administrator. 